What good YouTube, Scottsman985 here, welcoming you back to the channel. This is going to be my breakdown video for the Pokemon Sword and Shield trailer that we received today. Uh, as <laughs> I've had to record this video twice now, so I have seen the trailer. Uh, sadly, I couldn't get my first initial reaction. I uh, had a phone call first time, and then my mic was playing up the second time. So, we're going to jump into this, break down what I think of the trailer, and yeah we'll take it from there so if you like for this please leave a like on this video and subscribe if you are new now i just need to obviously de uh, copyright this so we're going to put this on slightly faster speed with no sound because i do not want the copyright police coming for me for this video because i've tried to record it three times already so let's jump in to this trailer. So we start off the trailer where it's showing more things that we've already seen before, like the gym leaders and Gigantamax and the wild area Dynamaxing. Then you've got Galarian forms and you get this ridiculous wheezing. Like this is like, look at this wheezing. It is a poison fairy type with levitate and an unknown ability. Looks insane. First thoughts uh, should be poison steel because of the funnels but i'm okay with it being poison fairy it is what it is zigzagoon the normal dark zigzagoon this thing looks brilliant linoon looks fantastic and then linoon evolves into what was it called again obstagoon the normal dark with reckless and guts now I have looked this up in between me recording these videos. Uh, it's only Galarian Lanoon that will evolve into Obstagoon. So that's going to be very interesting and a lot more videos you'll see on YouTube to come of what Galarian forms we're going to get and which will they evolve. And then will current Pokemon normally just evolve in Gala as well. So this is Obstagoon. I do like him. I think it looks far too much like Lycanroc, but I can forgive it. Pokemon form changes in Gala. So this is the Pikachu clone. This is Morpico. Uh, Morpico. We can go to Hangry Mode. Hangry Mode just reminds me of Emperor Zerg from Toy Story, if you've seen that film. Uh, Buzz Lightyear's arch enemy. Uh, I did make a meme about it. It's going to be on my Facebook page and probably on my Instagram. So link, I'll leave those links in the description below so you can see. But it's an electric dark type. Love that. Love electric types. One of the cooler Pikachu um, clones, I would say. Uh, I might rank all the clones of the Pikachu clones, but we'll, we'll see. But that is more Pico. It's so Emperor Zerg. So Emperor Zerg. And now we come to the rivals. So we have two new rivals of those things. There's this guy called Bead, who's got a Solosis. And then we have Marina, who is being protected by Team Yell. Now, I want to point this out. I think these look terrible. I am all for this game. I'm going to buy this game. I'm going to play this game. But I think Team Yell are awful. They're an evil team that are just wild fans of Marina. They're a wild fan of our rival. They want our rival to become the champion. And they'll try and get in our way. I think it's 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 a, it's a big no for me. I think this is... How have we gone from Team Rocket to Team Yell? I, I just don't get it at all. Really don't. It's a very... I just don't like them whatsoever. But they do have the Galarian forms... So they're going to have like the um, Zigzagoon Linoon. And then the very interesting part here is she throws a Pokeball and it cuts. So that does tell me the potential of a new Pokemon we haven't seen. We have seen in a couple of trailers. We've seen that little monkey that's been in my tier list. We've seen that um, elephant looking thing that was like thrown in the last trailer. But you didn't see it fully come out of the Pokeball. Um... There was some quite convincing leaks before this trailer came out and it the leaks predicted the 7th the trailer was going to drop predicted team yell 
predicted Galarian forms were predicted Hopip and Oddish, being fire and steel type respectively. Um, and so I don't know. And then right at the end, they said we're going to get just a silhouette of Eevee and then that's it. I think they're putting that in all the leaks because people know we want an evolution. Uh, this, after ha after a couple of hours of not having my just chance to show you my direct reaction, I'm kind of just a bit on the fence about this, where I think Galarian forms might be just going a little bit too on the lazy front when Alola forms were brilliant, but then how, how, how we've never had all these forms in Kanto and Hoenn and Johto and things like that. But as I say, I will be buying the games. It's not going to be just me hating on Sun and Moon, but I will be buying the games. I just maybe feel like this could have been a bit on the lazy front. Uh, down to like evolutions, uh, evolutions. Uh, I will perhaps be doing a video separately on the evolutions. But let me know in the comment section below what you think that mystery Pokemon will be in the trailer. And also let me know obviously what you think of the Galarian, Weezing, Zigzagoon, Linoon, and Obstagoon. Now, I just think Obstagoon, like, just just look at it and just, just <laughs> it's just, it's a Lycanroc. The way it stands, the way the head shape is, it's literally a Lycanroc, which I, I'm, I don't know, that that's going to be memed for a very long time. But, you know, taking it. Let's take it as it is. Having Reckless and Guts are two very powerful abilities. It has, and it's a it's a dark normal type, so do not mac punch it because that's gonna go down. So I will probably break down the Pokemon in the more ways that I think of their weaknesses and how good they're gonna be in a separate video. I'll be updating my tier list um, soon as well with obviously all these new these new Pokemon and then I adding the Galarian forms to it as well. And also let me know in the conversation, am I wrong about Team Yell or is this the is this worse than Team Skull, which I never thought I'd ever say. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comment section below what you think of all of this and look out for more Sword and Shield videos coming very, very soon. And that is going to be it for this video, guys. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Cheers, guys. See you soon. Bye-bye. Hashtag hate Team Yell.